Dorothy Dangers was born November 9, 1922 in Cleveland, Ohio. She found early success in show business by performing with her sister Vivian in a song and dance team called the Wonder Children. She performed throughout the South at black churches and other places and landed a number of small roles in films including the Marx Brothers classic A Day at the Races in 1937. On her own as a teenager, she danced with Harold Nicholas in 1941 in the musical Sun Valley Serenade. Her mother was also an actress, Ruby Dandridge, who left her husband while she was pregnant, so Dorothy unfortunately never had a relationship with her father. Around 1930, Dandridge and her family moved to L.A. and created a new group, the Dandridge Sisters, with Vivian and their friend Etta Jones. The group started performing major gigs at famous locations, including the Cotton Club in Harlem, and started performing with top acts like Cab Calloway and the Jimmy Lunceford Orchestra. Although they were successful enough to perform on stage, they were not allowed to eat in some of the restaurants at their performance venues. In 1942, Dandridge married Harold Nicholas. This was not a happy marriage. Nicholas reportedly chased other women, and Dorothy basically retired from performing during this time. She gave birth to their daughter in 1943. They named her Harolyn. They discovered that Harolyn had brain damage, and seeking to find a cure, Dandridge had Harolyn received expensive private care for multiple years. After divorcing Harold in 1951, Dorothy returned to the nightclub scene as a successful solo singer. She became an international star and performed at van glamorous venues in London, Rio de Janeiro, San Francisco, and New York. She won her first starring role in Bright Road in 1953, where she played an earnest young school teacher with Harry Belafonte.